Hey guys, Joe here. What is up? I hope you guys are safe and enjoying life in the new normal. Me, I'm doing awesome and I'm happy to show you another gadget for today's tech review. In today's episode, I'm going to introduce to you a microphone that is made for vloggers and interviewers like me. The Deity V-Mic D4 Duo. I'll give you guys an unboxing of what you will get in the box, talk about what makes this revolutionary microphone stand out in the market, and test it out in the field. So let's go and start with this video. In this short unboxing, you got the Deity D4 Duo microphone attached already on the Ryko shock mount with two Deity windshields and the 3.5mm TRS coiled cable. That is what's included in the box. Now, let's talk about what makes this microphone revolutionary. This is the first ever dual capsule microphone, which means not only you get to record what's in front of the camera, but also behind it. Yes, this microphone is made for interviewers and vloggers alike. No longer will you have to rotate the microphone whenever you want to narrate something to your audience. To take note, the rear microphone is less sensitive than the front. The reason why they set up the mic like that is because in a vlogging setup, especially we have other people or products introduced in the videos, the vlogger is nearer to the camera compared to other subjects. Now what if you want to isolate the audio in the front or use both capsules? All you need to do is toggle this switch. To use the front capsule as a solo audio capture, just toggle the switch to the front. If you want to use the front and rear capsule, toggle the switch to the rear. So you may be able to expand your options in capturing your audio. This microphone is super lightweight that it only weighs 40 grams, which makes it one of the lightest compact camera microphones in the market. The Rycode shock mount has interesting features which has quarter inch and 3 inch screws to allow you to mount on tripods and boom poles. The D4 Duo doesn't stop there because it also features a 3.5mm input jack. But why? Why would I need a 3.5mm input? This is where the power of the D4 Duo comes to play. So when you toggle your switch to the rear, it allows you to capture the front and rear scene. But when you input a device like a DUT VLAV, the rear microphone is now off because it's now powering and allowing the audio to capture in the front of the D4 Duo and also the lavier microphone. Now that we're done with the specs of this microphone, let's test these out in the field. Alrighty, so we are now going to test out the D4 Duo on my vlogging setup right now. Now I'm going to toggle the front switch, so I'm going to test out the front microphone of the DUT D4 Duo. So let's give this a try. Testing one, two, three. This is the front capsule of the D4 Duo. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Does it sound good or does it sound bad? Give a comment down in the comment section. Okay, now I'm gonna try out the rear capsule and how does it sound like without turning both of the capsules on. So the toggle switch is still in the front. So let's give this a try. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. This is a mic test for the rear capsule that is off. So the front capsule is on in this scenario. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Okay, now we are going to test out both of the capsules on. So now I'm gonna toggle the switch to the rear which will activate both of the capsule. So first, let me test out the front capsule. Testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three. This is the front capsule of the Deity D4 Duo. Testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three. So the reason why um, I put the microphone in arm's length is because this is how usually vloggers talk in front of the camera. It's usually arms apart when they're talking near to the camera. Now this is a mic test of the rear capsule. So now I'm talking behind the camera and does it sound good? Does it sound bad? 
Now, since it's less sensitive, I have to put the camera near me because as a camera operator, this is how um, cameramans usually operate using their vlogging gear. So testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three. This is the D4 Duo testing its rear capsule. Does it sound good? Testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three. So that's the test I did with the D4 Duo. What do you guys think about it? Let me know by commenting down in the comment section. DUT has done it again by introducing another revolutionary product that I'm sure a lot of people will enjoy its features. Anyways, this is my review of the DUT D4 Duo. I hope you guys learned something new about this tech review. If you did, share your support by giving a thumbs up and by sharing this video to your friends. Don't forget to hit the notification bell to be notified every time I post a new content such as this. Also, don't forget to like, follow, and subscribe to my social media accounts. This is Joe Serrano signing out, and I will see you in my next tech review. See you guys.